David, that looked like a good workout. Yeah, you know, really pleased with the, uh, not not really, you know, the outcome, um, the performance. You know, when you when you apply yourself and, and you know the minimum given at any football club should be hard work, honesty, sincerity in your performance. And we've come here uh, an experienced team, um, but I've seen experienced teams before not put the work in and not put the the shift in that, that's required. And um, you know, today the lads have, and uh, the experienced players that have come over have. We've travelled two and a half hours to, to get this game on. I really wanted the game on. It gave me a good chance to look at some of the players I've not seen in, in, a, in an 11 v 11 game, apart from training. And a, a fantastic workout, you know, and a really, really good performance um, from every single one of them. It's, it's been good for me to fuse, you know, the younger players with the, the experienced players. Uh, that's something that, you know, every club I've worked at, I've been very proud of. Um, and you... If you want to fuse and, and, and utilise your younger players in a squad, you know you have to have good pros around it. It's no good having bad pros around it because they don't learn the right intentions, they don't learn the right, learn the right values. And what I've seen today is a group of uh, professionals, um, young and experienced professionals, who set about the work, who's done the right thing, you know, against an inexperienced Wigan team. But sometimes them games are harder because you've got to keep. Uh, doing the right thing, you know, all the time, and uh, and they have done. They've committed to it, and it's great lesson for the younger players who come on for half an hour there to to play with them experienced players. So delighted on two aspects today: the performance and the way that two, you know, the academies knitted together with the first team. That's really important and going to be integral, you know, in my management management and leadership. Uh, in a nutshell, what were you most encouraged by? I think the front three of uh, Ricky Spence and. Liang, Liango just set the press off. They set the press. They set the energy. You know, backed up. Um, and and again, you know, we've we've done a training session this morning with the players over at um, over at the one call, and uh, you know we've had a fantastic session this morning with the players, and and then to come here and and, and take that hard work into yeah, it was a cup final, you know, and um, to take that work into into today's game. Uh, was excellent, but I noticed yesterday we had a really bright session from the boys. We set, did some setup shape, work with them uh, for this game, and uh, I could tell there was an intent wanting to. They, they wanted to win the game. That was a given. Uh, you should want to win any, every football match, but certainly, um, you know, I, the, 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 it was committed from the start of the game.